Hello friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel, Basic Course Service Now Learning. So in today's video, we are going to explore execution order of scripts and engine in Service Now. So when it comes to database operation such as insert and update, then the order of these events such as scripts, business rules, workflows, escalation, assignment rule, and engine is important in many cases. There are two basic scenarios for script execution. The first one is before the form submission to the server and the second one is after the form submission. So if we talk about the first scenario, we know that client based code like client script, UI policies, UI action client site gets executes in the browser before the form submission to the server, right? So in this video, we are going to talk about the second scenario that is after the form submission. So let's begin. So once the user submit the form, before business rule scripts order less than 1000 gets execute. Friends, before business rule basically are the scripts configured to execute before the database operation. Right. After that, before engines, that is approval engine, assignment rule engine, data policy engine, escalation engine, field normalization engine, role engine, workflow engine, update version engine, execution plan engine gets execute. After before engines, before business rule, scripts order greater than equals to 1000 gets execute. After before business rule scripts, database operations such as insert, update and delete gets performed. After the database operations, after business rule scripts order less than 1000 gets execute. So friends, after business rule basically are the scripts configured to execute after the database operation, right? So then after business rule, after engines like label engine, listener engine, table notification engine, role engine, text indexing engine, update sync engine, workflow engine and trigger engine gets execute. After that, email notifications executed based on the weight of record and email notification triggered on insert, update and delete and even though event based notifications will be triggered. Once the email notification gets triggered, after that, after business rule scripts order greater than equals to 1000 and only active records gets executes. So friends, we know that in ServiceNow platform, there are lots of engines, right? Which auto executed to perform several tasks on the background. So this is an execution order of scripts and engine, which will be performed once the user submit the form. So friends, if this video has given you some new information, then please like, share, and subscribe my YouTube channel. Thank you. Have a nice day.